Hey guys, pack your bags for a trip to another trip to Shining Vale Psychiatric Hospital as stars renewed Shining Vale for Season 2. The Season 2 renewal came just three weeks after the freshman horror comedy series ended its run in April. We are somewhat surprised that the network decided to give Shining Vale a second chance because the Season 1 ratings were not that good, just 200,000 viewers per episode. The IMDb viewer approval score is just also average at 6.8 out of 10. The hope is that The Shining Veil will grow on the audience, especially those viewers who love movies such as The Shining, Rosemary's Baby, and the Amityville Horror, which are heavily referenced in the show. The Shining Veil storyline is clever, the writing is brilliant, and the cast executed those family quips and witty one-liners perfectly. The main cast is star-studded and is confirmed to return for season two, led by 57-year-old Friends alum Courtney Cox, 58-year-old Oscar nominee Greg Kinnear, and 54-year-old Oscar winner for the 95 Woody Allen's movie Mighty Aphrodite, Mira Sorvino. Now, season one ended with a huge cliffhanger. When Pat is being taken to Shining Vale Psychiatric Hospital, she finds out that her house used to be a mental facility in the past, too. She recognizes Rosemary on an old photograph from 1859, which makes everything even more confusing, as we know Rosemary and her family died in 1954. So, was Rosemary a ghost? a reincarnation of another person, or a work of Pat's psychotic mind? Guys, share your theories in the comments with us, and thanks for hitting like for this video.